Sugarloaf Mountain dominates the skyline from almost all of Rio de Janeiro, including here in Copacabana Beach. Getting to the top just takes two short cable car rides, although for the more adventurous, climbing is an option. The top of Sugarloaf reveals Rio in a way that most people here say can't be beaten. You can see Copacabana and Ipanema, Botafogo and downtown Rio. Of course, watching overall is Corcovado, featuring the Christ the Redeemer statue. Rodrigo is a local resident. He has lived here his whole life, but this was his first trip to the top. That uh, represents the spirit of the nature of Rio de Janeiro. You can see the beauty of the city uh, all in a single place. Not everyone is so close. Hayden and Jordan spent 29 hours traveling from Australia. Three different flights. <laughs> Eight hours, seven hours, and 14 hours. Soccer fans from around the world have chosen Rio for their World Cup experience, and Sugarloaf Mountain is part of that. It's not unusual to see Brazilian and Colombian supporters taking a photo of a group of Germans. Alex and Christian also came to Rio from Germany. We've got the Alps, <laughs> but it's, uh, you can't uh, compare it with this. When your day on Sugarloaf Mountain is done, all that's left is the cable car ride back down. That is, of course, only if you choose not to take the helicopter. Brian Allen, VOA News, Rio de Janeiro.